outrage and calls for his impeachment. That's what followed after the President of the United States retweeted three anti-Muslim videos. The unverified videos purport to show Muslims attacking people and property. They were made public online by this woman. And some Muslims who are extremely hostile. Uh, Jada Franzen, an extreme right-wing British activist who's previously been charged with inciting hate speech against Muslims. The White House may not support her views, but it defends retweeting her videos. The threat is real, and that is what the president is talking about. That's what the president is focused on, is dealing with those real threats. Uh, and those are real no matter how you look at it. Normally a close ally, the British prime minister, through her spokesman, condemned Donald Trump as being wrong. On Capitol Hill, this Democratic congressman said the videos were nothing more than hate and called on members to take action against the president. When hate emanates from the presidency, the solution is impeachment. Trump's positions are not new. When speaking about ISIL or even Al-Qaeda, the president has historically insisted on stressing that he believes the groups are made up of radical Islamic terrorists. On the campaign trail for president, Trump also called for a total and complete shutdown of Muslims entering the United States. And in the first days of his presidency, Trump implemented the first in a series of executive orders blocking travelers from some Muslim-majority countries. The policies have been challenged in the courts, characterized as nothing more than a ban on Muslims. The largest Islamic civil rights group in the United States has also condemned the president's tweets and accused him of inciting violence against Muslims. This is endangering uh, our safety as Americans. It's endangering the safety of American uh, Muslim kids in schools, uh, Muslim workers, even members of the Muslim community in the military. In the United States, copyright law allows for the fair use of copyrighted material under certain limited circumstances without the prior permission from the owner. Under the law, determinations of fair use take into account the purpose of the use, the nature of the copyrighted work, the amount and substantiality of the work used in relation to the work as a whole, and the effect of the use upon the potential market for the copyrighted work. Other jurisdictions may have similar copyright provisions protecting fair use or fair dealing. If you are uncertain as to whether a specific use qualifies as a fair use, you should consult a qualified copyright attorney. You have the right to take it down.